Hi there, this is just a short video to show you how you can use Copy to enter your comic book collection fast. Copybase comes with the world's largest database of comic books, containing current prices and information on well over a million different comics, as well as books, magazines, and more. With all this information already built in, it takes most of the work out of entering your own collection, no matter how big it is. For the most part, all you have to do is look up the books you've got in the database, say how many copies you have, and in what condition, and Copybase will take care of the hard work of keeping your collection organized, filling you in on the details of each comic, and telling you what it's all worth. Comicbase gives you a number of different ways to enter your data, and you might choose different methods depending on what you're interested in tracking, the value of your collection, or other factors. What I'm going to do right now is I'm going to grab a bunch of comic books that I've got here to enter, and we'll step through each of the different ways in turn, and I'll show you how they all work. The first and most basic way to enter a comic is to just start typing its name in the search bar at the top of the screen. Comicbase will automatically fill in the matching titles when you start typing, and when you see the title you want, just press return to see all the issues of that title. Then, scroll down to the issue you've got, put in the quantity you own for that issue, change up the condition if it's not near mint, and you're all set. Comicbase will automatically calculate the current market price based on condition, and add this comic to your collection reports and totals. Then, you're ready to move on to the next one. One quick tip, on titles with a large number of issues, you can save time by using the jump command, or type F3 on your keyboard, to jump directly to a particular issue. This will save you a lot of time scrolling on titles like Batman or Action Comics. For many comics, noting the condition and quantity may be all you really care about, but you can certainly get into as much detail as you want, particularly with very valuable books. To do detailed data entry on a comic, select the row by clicking at the far left column, then pressing enter, or just double click on the far left column. From the detailed entry screen, you can look at all the specifics for this comic and track the information that's important to you. When you're all done, just click save to save your changes. If you've got a whole bunch of comics you want to enter at once, you can highlight all their rows by selecting from the far left column, then using one of my favorite features, One Key Issue Entry. Just type a number between 0 and 9 on your keyboard, and all the selected items will instantly be set to that quantity. You can also use plus or minus to add or subtract to the quantity of the items you've selected. If you're the type of person who keeps their collection in order by title, particularly if they're all in near mint, this method lets you blaze through its data entry faster than anything else. Whenever you're selecting rows in Comicbase, you can use a couple of common tricks to get exactly what you want faster. You can select an entire range of rows by clicking at the top, then holding Shift down and clicking at the bottom. Holding down the Control key when selecting lets you mark particular rows as part of the same selection, whether they're next to each other or not. And finally, the Select All command under the Edit menu, or just pressing Ctrl A, selects all the rows in a list. Sometimes you want to record something about a lot of items at once. Let's say you just bought a bunch of books at the local yard sale for a buck a piece, and you want to note their cost. You can easily make these sorts of edits to a single field by using the Quick Change command. Just highlight the books in question, Select Quick Change from the Edit menu, or press Ctrl G, then choose which field you want to change. In this case, we're going to set the cost field to a dollar. Press Make Changes, and all the books will have their cost set at once. Sometimes it can be difficult to figure out the proper title of a comic, so instead of searching by title, you can also look up items by typing in their full barcode into the search area, or better yet, scan the code in with a barcode scanner. This jumps you straight to the comic in question, and its row will be automatically selected so you can set its quantity by just pressing the numbers 0 to 9 on your keyboard, or pressing Enter to do more detailed data entry. If you've got the Pro or Archive editions of Comicbase, you can scan whole stacks of comics in seconds using the Add by Barcode command under the Items menu, Control i Just beep in the books like a supermarket checkout, and click Save. You can also check the box at the bottom to display the issues you've just added to work with them further. I use this to quickly print ID labels for everything. Another of Comicbase's very cool features. 
Well, that's about it for now. Make sure you check out the Help Menus user guide for more information on everything we've covered here, and also check out the Comic Base TV YouTube channel for live streams and other tutorials. Until next time, we'll see you then.